What did you make, Grace? A daddy sized tower. Wow, that is really long. That's she, almost like a train track. She first started it yeah. and then I came it's in and started helping her. Do you think you're going to make it any bigger? I gotta study the tower. The boys are playing Jenga and it's pretty high. 33 high. Thir You're kidding me? No, right there. Yes! I hope Peter wins. I hope Peter wins. You are going to lose, hopefully. Ow! No. So long. Farewell. Yeah. Dangerous. That's a Uh-oh, there we go. This oh. will be a loud <laughs> oh! one. Hi, Hi, thank you so much. Good morning, it is Saturday and we are heading on home. We got on the road a little bit later than we would have liked, but that's just how life goes with kids. We are on our way outside of Detroit, heading into Toledo. We ran into a, a fairly large section of the highway that was closed, so we ended up detouring. And what do you think, Art? That was added probably about 30 minutes. Yeah, it was quite a while. Yeah, I'm going to say added about 30, 40 minutes into our drive time. But, you know, we have no control over that. Uh, uh, Art's cousin made a wonderful breakfast to us, and we had a wonderful time there. Um, I had never met her, Art had met her in the past, um, but it was, we had a great time. I'll try to throw in a couple of the pictures that I took. Um, I didn't do it with the video camera, but I have some still shots. I'll try to throw those in here for you guys. And the kids just had an absolute blast playing and it worked out really, really well having that downtime last night and into today. Um, but now we've got quite, quite a drive going home. We're down to about, I think, nine, nine and a half hours left. It's gonna be a long day. Wow, there's a shipping yard here, and it's, they're loading the shipping containers onto a train. Isn't that cool? Yeah, Detroit is a part city. There it is. Welcome to Ohio. There's another train yard. We're gonna have a big, long train. That's a lot of train tracks, Art. Yes, it is. Is that a bridge, that spike thing? That was like a suspension bridge. Ah. I wonder if we're going to go over it. I think so. I don't remember that on our other trips. Yeah, I don't either. I don't know if we ever went this way, though. That is oh, yeah. Really that is really cool. Yes. Can you the mommy? I am. You are on video.
the kids about dead man's oh, curve. Well, they are calls a dead man's curve. I it's, think that's what they call it from around here. It's, dead man's curve. it's a 35 mile an hour curve on a 50 mile an hour highway. And you can see all the traffic in the other lane is, um, it's moving pretty slow. Um, I think they put the rumble strips up here, don't they? Yes, and then they have a whole bunch of lights and everything. They like you know, so watch out. Right. Hey, the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. There we go, we could go there. Quarter mile, 35 mile. What's your honey? I'll tell you. Here we go. You. There. Making sure people are aware, there's a corner coming. This is cool. You like this, kids? I remember this. I definitely remember this. Airplane! And I, you know, I was correct. It's right around the river. And the airplane's coming in. And I was correct. It's right around the river. Oh, yeah, and there's um, Aren't those like there's normal Lake, curves? Uh, Lake Erie right there. Yep. Aren't these like normal curves? No. All right, going to Erie, PA. Where's P Pennsylvania? Pennsylvania? Several times when we've come through Cleveland here, up into Dead Man's Corner, going towards Michigan, we actually hit the traffic bad, and we've caught awful, awful bumper-to-bumper -bumper stop and go traffic. Remember that, Art? Yes. So going into Dead the Man's corner, trip. and so ever since, we always try to time our trips that we're not coming through on rush hour. Today's Saturday, so we don't really have to worry about that, um, but there still is a considerable amount of traffic. But it's, it's strange that you have to think about that when you're traveling, you know, because if you, if you even change your time, even by an hour, that could be the difference of a couple hours of waiting in line or, you know, being able to go right through. There's Lake Erie over there, and they have a little lighthouse. I don't know if you guys can see it. But the walkway with the wa rocks, there's lots of ice on it, and then there's a little tiny lighthouse. Where's the little tiny lighthouse? And here's the lighthouse. We can't see it now because we just went behind the, whatchamacallit. There it is, there it is. Oh, is that in the middle of the lake? Cool. There it is, a little lighthouse right there. The water is kind of a funny color. I wonder if that's because of the, because it's cold. miles driven this week. That was a long drive. It is really good to be home and we are ready to get inside. So we're going to say good night and I hope you enjoyed the video and we will see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night.